And Delta government have slammed deputy president of the Senate and governorship candidate of the All Progressive Congress, APC, over a purported letter warning banks to stop advancing loans to the governor of Cowell's government. Commissioner for Information, Charles Anyago, who spoke at a news conference in Asaba, said Omoagege has no right, no power, to stop the government from carrying out any constitutional action. There has never been any time that we do the backdoor thing like some persons will do. So, first it's important you tell him that he does not have the power. You can see even a supporter is supposed to be the number two lawmaker in the Senate. He does not even know where his power stops. He is sitting in the Senate and warning a state government or warning a bank. Is he CBN governor? Or he has been, even the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria cannot warn a bank not to deal with a state. Once you meet the condition precedent for something to happen, the president cannot warn anybody to say, don't deal with this. Aniago said that every leader in Nigeria has the right to choose the candidate that they want. I begrudge either the Labour Party candidate, neither him nor former president Ulysse Gun or Basanjo, for the position taken by the former president. As a presidential council, our presidential candidate and his running mate are very much aware from the onset that we're going into a contest with other contestants, so in which case it's going to be a competitive election. The only thing that gives us hope is that we have got the competitive edge to be able to win, because when you proceed to tick the boxes as to the requirements of whoever is going to occupy that position, to face the many challenges confronting our country, Atiku Abubakar and Okowa ranks very, very top. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.